defense mechanisms are the brain's way of keeping us safe from being fully aware of unpleasant thoughts and feelings. Sometimes, we can choose to use certain defense mechanisms like repression, denial, and rationalization. Below is a list of 10 of the most common defense mechanisms. 1. Displacement The diversion of emotions, such as anger, from the original source to a substitute target. For example, your friend says something hurtful, and instead of confronting your friend, you later lash out at your sister. 2. Projection The projection of one's own feelings, thoughts, or motives onto someone else. For example, a person who is cheating is under the impression that their partner is cheating on them. 3. Rationalization Developing false, though plausible, excuses to justify irrational and or unacceptable behavior. For example, Stealing from a corporate chain store, such as Best Buy, and justifying the theft by saying, they make millions in profit, so it doesn't matter. 4. Reaction formation. Behaving in a way opposite to how you feel. For example, when a person is romantically attracted to someone, but adamantly claims that they dislike the someone. 5. Regression. Reverting to childlike patterns of behavior. For example, a student gets a bad grade on their test and screams and cries at their parents or teacher. 6. Repression Denial Pushing or burying thoughts and feelings that are distressing into the subconscious. For example, an addict will deny they have an addiction because they can function fine at work and at home. An example of repression would be a person who witnesses a crime being unable to remember the event. 7. Sublimation the refocusing of unacceptable impulses, thoughts, and or emotions into more acceptable ones. For example, a person who is experiencing aggressive impulses instead challenges that energy into rigorous exercise. 8. Dissociation The detachment from reality and from one's self, and the finding of another representation of self to cope with extreme stress or conflict. A person who uses dissociation as a defense mechanism disconnects from reality and lives in their own world, in which they do not experience unbearable thoughts, feelings, or memories for a period of time. 9. Intellectualization Overthinking and the misdirection of focus when confronted with unacceptable situations, behaviors, or impulses. For example, a person who has been told a close family member has died begins to focus on and overthinks the details of planning a funeral, etc instead of expressing their grief. 10. Compensation. The counterbalancing of perceived flaws or weaknesses by instead emphasizing strengths. For example, a person says they can't draw, but they're really good at dancing. What defense mechanisms do you use? Share your thoughts with us below. Also, don't forget to subscribe and check out our Patreon. Thanks for watching! Hey everybody, I just want to give a personal thank you video for you guys for always supporting Psych2Go and making this all possible for us. Our vision is to make psychology as accessible as possible so that it promotes self-awareness and it helps you guys grow. However, we want to make more content for you guys and would love your support in buying one of these bracelets from our partner, Introvert Palace. Check out the bracelet, it's pretty cool and it even includes Pluto. The link to purchase will all be in the description below and I hope you guys have an amazing day. Bye!